FNN. Headline News Update. Good morning, folks. This is Steve Rhodes coming to you live from the shores of sunny Delray Beach, Florida. This is your 11 a.m. 11 a.m. update, and currently we have all the U.S. indices trading to the downside. Dow's off 1%, 332 points there. About 1% for the S&P, 38 points. A half a percent for the NASDAQ 100, that'd be 64 points. Russell's down 1 and 3 tenths, or 24 points. Semi's off about 1%, 24 points the downside. Trendy's off nearly 2%, 242 points. Gold's trading out at 1674, that's back 4 bucks. Silver's off 15 cents, trading out at 1919. Lights we crude off a buck 32, trading at 84.41. Natural gas trade out at 777. Ring the cash register out there in the 30 Treasury back one point and 11 ticks. 130.01 is the print. Let's look at our nine panel market update chart. We begin by taking a look at the ES Mini. What's the ES Mini have? It has a buy the D point pattern that uh, formed and completed uh, last Friday when it formed a bullish uh, hammer candle. It was followed up with a bullish engulfing yesterday. Now, if price closed below 38.53, that would be the bottom. Well, really, the true level now would be the low of yesterday, which is 38.46 and a quarter. I'll have to change that. A close below 38.46 and a quarter would suggest that we have a new A to B equals CD to the downside with an initial price projection of 37.29. There is a new daily profile that is attempting to form. What I mean by that is Stevie's using his advanced Doppler tool. And that says that we will not get a confirmation of this profile, which has supported 3879, resistance at 4010 until this evening. Spot volatility is still well above its 50-day exponential moving average. It's trading out at 2653 and the 50 days at 2463. As long as price remains above that 50-day exponential moving average, rug pulls can and do happen. If we take a look at the NQ, just like the ES Mini, it confirmed a buy the D point pattern. That's not the one that's shown in here right now. It's a smaller pattern out there. And if price were to close below 11778, that would set up a larger A to B equal CD to the downside. Now, you've got a daily buy the bottom, buy the D point, I should say. You've got a new profile that's also attempting to form. 11899 is the support area, and 12382 is where resistance is at. Now, those profiles, again, will not be confirmed until this evening. U.S. dollar index is trading with inside a new profile that formed yesterday. Support at 108.97, resistance 109.99. Gold is trading below a new profile that formed yesterday. That's a bearish uh, signal. Light, uh, silver is found, found resistance. Nice rally, but continues to find resistance at the top of the weekly profile. That's where the sellers reside, $19.57. Folks, stay tuned for the Trader's Edge show, if you will. But if you're off to start your day, please have a terrific Tuesday, and we'll look forward to seeing you again soon. Take care now.